Hello and welcome to the world of recipes. I'm Vaishali and today we are going to make a very very famous Indian sweet dish that is rabdi. This rabdi can be eaten separately or it is an accomplishment with so many other sweet dishes like gulab jamun, jalebi and it can be frozen to make a malai kulfi also. So let's get started and let's see the ingredients. For rabdi we need milk one and a half liter sugar i have taken four tablespoon of sugar you can increase i don't like it too sweet so i have taken only four tablespoon sugar here these are 10 almonds and 10 cashews i have cut them lengthwise it looks good in rubbery like this then some cardamom powder this is one tablespoon of cardamom powder and few strands of saffron let's start making rubbery now A small tip, whenever you are going to make rabdi, just add a tablespoon of water to the bottom of the vessel. When we add this water, it won't allow uh, milk to stick at the bottom. And we are going to use a thick bottom vessel for this. Now I will pour in this milk. I will add in the sugar. Mix the sugar well with the milk. We'll add in this saffron as well. The saffron is going to give nice color to this rubbery. Keep stirring it. See, the milk has started to boil. Now, lower the flame. If you're standing near the gas stove and continuously stirring this uh, rubbery, then keep it on the medium flame. Or you have to simmer it if you're doing some other work with that. Because it is going to take time. Now as you can see this cream is forming on the top of the milk. We have to just take it to the sides and stick it to the vessel on the sides like this. Now we need to keep uh, doing this till our milk reduces to one third. Every time the malai comes on top, you have to take it to the side and stick it on the sides of the vessel. Now as you can see, milk has reduced little bit. At this moment, we will add this almonds and cashews and cardamom powder too. Mix it well. Now as you can see, this milk has reduced to one third. We started with one and a half liters of milk and it is around half liter only now and you can see uh, all the cream has gathered on the edges of the pan. We'll scrape out all this cream and mix it with the thickened milk. Scrape it nicely from all the sides. And mix it with the milk. Now you can see our rubber is so thick and creamy. After cooling down, this will thicken more and you will have nice and creamy rabdi. Now we have scraped all the cream from all the sides of this. Now we will let it cool down and then we will serve it. After cooling down, you can see our rabdi is ready. Nice and thick and creamy rabdi is ready. Let's serve it. Enjoy this delicious rabdi. And for more recipes like this, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Keep on watching World of Recipes. Thank you.